What's up YouTube? Today we're going to talk about how you can use templates to quickly start uh, your projects in machine. It's a handy way to um, have uh, multiple setups by using different templates. So I'm going to show you how to set up the templates. I'm going to show you how to tag them so that you can get to them quickly within your library. Uh, so yeah, let's get to it. So to create a template, I'm going to go to all groups and I'm in the machine tab. So I'm going to go to prospect haze expansion kit then go to types and kits, then urban kit. This is going to give me all my drum um, kits. And let's just go for I don't know, Cali kit. Okay, now I'm also wanting to add a melodic kit there, so let's go with Extra Roads kit. And I've created a new group to facilitate that. Okay, so we're happy with the template. I've got my um, drums here. I can just name it drums just for the sake of the tutorial. So drums. And then we can rename this as a melodic kit. Uh, melodic kit. Like that. And now I can go ahead and save this. But I want to save as, not save. Because if I do save, then it will uh, save over this uh, new project, which is the default template when you load machine or when you start a new uh a new project that is the default template so save as i'm just going to name it name it as test and whenever you're naming your templates they have to be saved inside of a folder so i've named the folder test and it's on the desktop down here no problem. Now, to access my template, I need to be in the user tab and in the all projects tab. If I scroll to the bottom, there is test. Okay. Now, to access it quicker, I can add some tags to it. So it will save me from scrolling through all of this. So I can go to. Um, so I'll highlight test and then go to edit and then I could for example just tag it with templates and hit apply now if, as you see when I hit templates it now shows test now obviously you can go a bit further you can set up um, multiple templates and they could be ones whereby you have instruments loaded just to make EDM tracks or trap chat tracks, hip hop tracks, pop tracks, house tracks, what have you. And you can go ahead and use this tagging system to have them under uh, templates. But then also you can then go a step further and add more tags. So the tags could be hip hop, house, EDM, trap, etc. And you can access your templates even faster by just adding um, tags to each template now one last thing i want to show you is when you have saved your template and you've got it all set up and you've got the tags in place you must and this is important you must go to where you saved your template on your computer and you need to set it to lock and you need to set the um you need to turn on stationary pad so to do that on osx is you right click on the template file go to get info click stationary pad and locked just close those off there now the reason why i say that you have to do this is because when you are in the middle of making your beat you don't want to have this the scenario where you've um, saved um, over the template. You don't want to save over the template. And by setting the stationary pad and setting the 
the template file to lock it now will not save project could not save cool so you're not overwriting the overwrite i'm getting tongue tied so you're not um overwriting the template file but the way to save your beats is to go to save as and then you can put the uh the file into whichever folder you want you can name the beat whatever you want to name it and that's how you will save your beats from templates thanks for watching i hope this helped rate comment subscribe leave any comments below and um, hit the website blogforbeats.com where you can get all your free uh, vsts for machine and you can check out beat uh, making videos and machine tips and also hit machine minute tips.com where that's a mailing list you can join that mailing list and i'll be throwing out some tips on how to use machine studio controller and um, some other stuff that i don't put on the websites but just purely for the people that are on the list thanks for watching again guys and i'll catch you in the next one